Okay guys, so in this video we'll be taking a look at collecting like terms involving algebra. So this is aimed at predominantly key stage 3 maths but it's also appropriate for GCSE foundation tier and higher tier as well. Okay, and I got this from the Corbett Maths textbook exercise for collecting like terms. So it's part of the algebra topic within GCSE and Key Stage 3 Maths. Okay, as ever guys, feel free to pause the video, try and attempt all the questions that you can do, and then come back and press play and feel free to take any notes if you need to join the course of this video. Okay, we're going to start with question number 1a. Simplify it to the following. Y plus Y plus Y plus Y. So think of it as I've got 1P plus 1P plus 1P plus 1P. I've got 4P, but instead of P, I've got the letter Y. So I've got four lots of Y, which I write as just 4Y without the time sign. Okay, so the answer is 4Y. Okay, I don't usually write Y4. Okay, because that can be misinterpreted as y to the power of 4. We always write the number first and then the letter next to it. Okay, part B, w plus w plus w plus w plus w, that's equal to 5 lots of w, which is just 5w. Okay, 5w means 5 times w, 5 lots of w. Part C, A plus A plus A plus A plus A plus A is equal to 7 lots of A, which is just 7A, guys. Part D, S plus S plus S is equal to 3 lots of S, which is just equal to 3S. Okay, part E, N plus N is equal to 2N. Okay, part F, G plus G plus G plus G minus G. So let's just deal with it bit by bit. So G plus G plus G plus G is 4G. Take away 1G, I've got 3G. Okay, imagine I'm taking away 1G there. Okay, I've got the number 1 in front of all these. Okay, then that will make it a bit more easier to understand. Okay, I've got 4G, take away 1G, which is 3G. Next one, I've got y plus y plus y plus y, take away y, take away y. Well, y plus y plus y plus y is 4y. Take away 1y is 3y, take away another y becomes 2y. Okay, two lots of y, which is just 2y. Okay, let's just write that 2 again. Okay, so it becomes 2y. Okay, part H, P plus P minus P minus P. Well, P plus P goes to 2P, minus P goes to 1P, minus P goes to 0. Okay, so think of it as I've got 2P minus 2P, which goes to 0. Okay, part I, 3Y plus 2Y is 5Y. Okay, part J, 4A plus 3A goes to 7A, guys. Okay, collecting my A terms together. Okay, part K, 9K plus 5K is, oops, is 14K. Okay. Okay, I think that one went a bit over the top there, guys. Okay. 7m plus 1m is equal to 8m. Okay. 15c plus 20c is 35c. Okay. So this is what I mean by collecting like terms. I can collect all the letters. It has to be like the same letter and the same base that I can collect. 6w take away 3w is equal to 3w. Okay. 3w. Part O, 10y plus 3y is 13y. Take away 5y goes to 8y. 
part P, 20T take away 14T goes to 6T. Okay, part Q, 7X take away 3X is 4X, take away another X goes to 2X. Okay, remember, if you're ever unsure yeah, if you're taking away a letter, you're taking away one lot of that letter, okay? 8K minus 8K goes to 0. Okay, think of it as I had eight pounds and I spent eight pounds. I have nothing left over, so I've got zero pounds left over. I've got nothing left over. Okay, seven Y take away two Y is five Y plus that one Y goes to six Y. Okay, imagine I've got that invisible one there. Five U take away four U is just equal to one U. Okay, or I can just write it as just U. Okay, but you are welcome to write it as one U if you want. But I tend to not write the one there. Okay, because it's getting into that habit of knowing that U is just one lot of U. Y squared plus Y squared is two Y squared. Okay. A squared plus A squared plus A squared goes to three lots of A squared, which is three A squared. Okay, it's three times A squared. Okay, this one collecting all these together, I get five C squared. Okay. Next one, seven Y squared plus three Y squared goes to ten Y squared. Okay. Next one, collecting my W squared terms together, okay, 2W plus 4W, sorry, 2W squared plus 4W squared is 6W squared plus the 8W squared becomes 14W squared. Okay, next one, 6y squared take away 2y squared is 4y squared plus 3y squared goes to 7y squared, okay? Or another way of thinking about it, minus 2y squared plus 3y squared is just plus 1 lot of y squared, okay? 6y squared plus y squared is 7y squared, okay? So that, that is like another way of looking at it, okay? Right guys, that's the end of today's short, sharp video on collecting like terms involving algebra. So I sincerely hope you found it useful. I hope you found it informative. If you did, please press like. Please subscribe to the channel if you're new. And lastly, please click that bell icon so you don't miss out on further videos and further uploads. Okay, but that's it from me today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Take care, stay safe, stay healthy, and I will see you all in the next video. Okay, bye for now.